Bimbingut, Catalan for welcome. Welcome back to Pete's Pans, where my travels have brought me to the province of Lleida. You may have heard it referred to as Lerida in Castilian Spanish, but you won't hear much of that around here in deepest Catalonia. So Lleida it is. And this, my dear gastro pilgrims, is Monfalco Murayat. Murayat simply meaning walled, walled in, as you can clearly see. And this fortified hamlet provides the setting for a superb old Catalan thing of conil a la cachola, rabbit casserole, with a sauce thickened in a tremendously traditional Catalan manner. More about that in a minute. This is one of the best preserved medieval towns in Catalonia. The 15 houses, along with the church, are very snugly enclosed within the protective walls, presumably originally to keep the Musulmanes, the Muslims, out. One legend has it that its inhabitants, having taken refuge within the walls, the assailants began to catapult messages inside, tied to pieces of bread, making it clear that they faced starvation unless they surrendered. In response, the villagers lobbed their own messages back, attached to fresh fish. Ha! Get the point? No surrender took place and the siege was abandoned. I'm using a cachola de fang, one of these traditional clay pots, but no need. For two people, half a decent sized rabbit will do. Oh, and terribly important is the liver, as you'll see in a bit. No skill required to cut up a rabbit, as the butcher in nearby Tarrega demonstrates. Toasted almonds and hazelnuts, along with the liver, are used to flavour, texture and thicken the sauce. Onion, tomato, garlic and herbs. Thyme, bay and rosemary if available. A drop of the well-loved local white, or if you find yourself in these parts, be rancy, literally rancid wine, loved by the locals and perhaps a bit of an acquired taste, but it's much better than the name suggests, somewhat akin to a dry sherry, but in any case, white wine is just as common in the recipes I've seen, chicken stock and olive oil. The trick I'm using to make the pan non-stick is frying an onion in oil before we start, really nice and hot. And you know, it really works a treat for all types of pan.
So yes, la picada, this nutty, lumpy, flavorful, thickening paste about which entire books are written, for centuries crushed up by mortar by Catalan ladies, along with the sofrito, the essence of their cookery. Here, rabbit stewed in a tomato and onion sofrito, flavored with local wines and finished with a typical picada. All the flavors of Catalonia are in this cassola. Bon profit. <laughs>